What's up everybody, today I'm going to show you how to change the ambient light sensor on a 2010 Chevrolet Traverse. So, you want to go to the A-pillar on the driver's side, that's where we are right now. There is a little cap here, it says airbag, you need to slide a pick or a shim or something under that and pop it off. It's it's hard to explain, I don't really know the best way to do it without, um, without the nicking it a little bit. But you just got to pop that off, under that is a 7 millimeter bolt take that bolt out and then down here you will see that there is a tweeter connector um, so don't so um, what you do take the trim piece you just you just took the bolt out take the trim piece slide it up a little bit and then set it back down so you can unhook this connector here and you just press this button in hold that pull it out simple as that now we want to go to the other side of the car and then you will see uh, it's basically the same thing except this side you've got a handle so you need to take uh, off two of those little uh, plastic covers and then underneath that is you've got there and there is two 10 millimeter bolts so just undo those same thing as before pull the trim just pull the trim up a little bit up a little bit set it back down unhook that tweeter wire there good to go on that side now then you got uh, this trim, just ignore, what is it, just ignore this thing, this is aftermarket. But um, you got this trim piece. Once you got these things out, you're able to be able to just lift this up here. And you can see that there's these little uh, slots where you got them clips going in there. So you just kind of pop it off. There is, on this side, there is, um, there's, there's a couple that are right next to each other. There's a, there's a, there's a upholstery clip. And like a little plastic tab so this like this particular spot here can be slightly tricky sometimes and you might need to get a little pry bar or something under it but the rest of it should just pop off if you have an experience with fabric clip fabric fabric clips taking your trim off whatever you know same deal as this so then you finally got your sensor here now whoops sensor here now this will be in the trim piece itself now it's really not obvious how to get it out how you get it out is put a pair of pliers on this or a wrench and gently but firmly turn it clockwise about a sixth of a turn so you know it'll be, it'll be facing straight up so you're going to move your wrench or whatever to the left and um, it shouldn't break anything it should it should kind of slowly kind of turn like that and then it'll just drop right out then if you want to replace this there's just this little oops there's just this little plastic clip here so you pry this part up you pry that part up with your fingernail, pull the thing out, swap it, good to go. And just reverse those steps when you want to put your car back together. Now, this will not fix the driver information center dimming issue, but if you do need to replace your thing here, um, like your car is not recognizing when it's nighttime or whatever, and you actually need to replace that ambient light sensor, that's how you do it. Thanks for watching. If you like this, leave a like, leave a comment. Any questions or whatever, put them down there. Thanks for watching. Catch you later.